night of history in gymnasiums around central Massachusetts. We have a Notre Dame Academy, Molly Terry getting her 1,000th career point, and the Grafton girls basketball team qualifying for the districts for the first time in a decade, and we were there. The Indians starting us off at home, taking on Lester, Shelby Turpin, and Grafton having a great season. Second quarter, Lester's Megan Steiger with the hoop. Wolverines down by five. Grafton's Gabriella LeMay. Beyond the arc, spots up and nails it. Indians up by eight. More Grafton. Megan Montgomery. Little leaner. Count it. Grafton up 11. More from the Indians, more from Montgomery. Putting it to the floor, the drive to the hoop. Off the window, into the teeth of the defense. Grafton up 13. LeMay going coast to coast. Hoop in the hack. Grafton is up big. And Shelby Tur Turpin, the drive, the finish. Grafton going on to win this one. 51 to 11, and they qualify for the districts. Notre Dame Academy taking on St. Bernard's. Molly Terry coming in just 15 points shy of the milestone of 1,000. First quarter, NDA's Terry feeding Allie Smiley for the basket. They should have been feeding Terry. NDA up by one. Terry kicking it out to Annie Spillane. Spillane drills a three. NDA by eight. Shouldn't they be passing to Molly Terry? St. Bernard's, Sabrina Patton with the steal. Patton dropping home two. St. Bernard's down by 11. And it's Terry. The steal. Terry taking it down the court. Nice Euro step. I think that's what Conor calls those. She's 11 away from 1,000. NDA up 11. Terry beyond the arc. She's got three. She is now six away from 1,000. Second quarter. Alana Keating. Three. St. Bernard's down by 12. Patton down the court to Morgan Gelinas for the hoop. St. Bernard's down by seven. More St. Bernard's. Gelinas, the runner through the defense. St. Bernard's is within three. Loose ball. Picked up by Terry. Terry going coast to coast. She is now just two points shy of 1,000. Terry has it. Here it is. Don't blink. Yes, the ball went in. She gets her 1,000th career point. Congratulated by the team. Athletic director Patty Provost. Her coach. Her parents coming out on the court. Great moment for Molly Terry. Congratulations on her 1,000th career point. Notre Dame Academy getting the win as well, 70 to 44. All right, we got Northbridge and Tantasqua girls basketball, third quarter. Shaylee O'Donnell off the give and go. Northbridge down by two. Tantasqua's Abigail Corvo beyond the arc. Warriors up by five. Mary McLaughlin pulling out the range finder. McLaughlin with the long jumper, Rams down three. Fourth quarter, Tantasqua's Joni Howland with the runner. More from Tantasqua. Lily Lucas collecting the loose ball in a circus shot by Lucas. I don't know how she got that one to go, but that's a pretty shot. Tantasqua gets the win, 39-31. <coughs> Chris Colabella with Dr. Blute and Bob Weldon at the Boston Baseball Writers Association dinner tonight. Colabello getting the Ben Mondor Award as the New England Player of the Year. Chris talking it up with Mookie Betts and Xander Bogarts and with Red Sox president Dave Dombrowski. Wouldn't that be great if the Sox ever got him? He is still under contract with the Blue Jays. Again, congratulations to Colabello named New England Player of the Year by the Boston Baseball Writers Association. Tomorrow night, we will be at the Hart Center Holy Cross and Canisius. Men's hockey dropping the puck at 7 p.m. Satyrs playing very well right now. They are in second place in Atlantic hockey. So there we go. We'll have some good hockey tomorrow night. Nice award for Chris Colabello tonight. Still hard to believe that he goes from all those years with the tornadoes now to being a contributor on a team that gets to the ALCS. It's crazy. You know, getting a big award like this, and, he, you know, he's up yucking it up with all these big league players, and obviously they all know who he is. It's a... Small fraternity up there. It's a, it's a Disney movie, certainly. Uh, and we talked about it earlier, too, but getting 1,000 points in a high school career yeah. is certainly a special oh, accomplishment. Oh, it's a great milestone. And, you, it's, you know, you can't be a good player for one year no. or two years. I mean, that's 
three, four years of varsity play. Absolutely. All right, thanks, Kev. Appreciate it. All right, for Kevin Shem, Tim McCone, thanks for watching. We'll see you back here tomorrow night at 6.